What was your your, your first int introduction to music? Did, 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 did your brother or sister or your mom and dad, were they into something and that you were... Um, yeah, we listened to music all the time. It was... Um, but I, I think I was so much into into the Disney movies, and uh, when I was six, yeah. I saw The Little Mermaid for the first time, and that just blew me away. You know, this girl, this mermaid, and when she opens her mouth to sing underwater as well, uh, everybody just, something magical happens, and everybody starts to listen, and I think that, that was mind-blowing for me, at least, to the whole story. The whole concept. You know. Yeah. And the music then? Was it specifically the music or the story? No, the story, of course. But, um, yeah, we listened a lot to like Prince and Michael Jackson and Soul and stuff like that at home. But um, we listened to everything, really. But is there one person, I mean, Normally, when you grow up, or normally mm. when, when you grow up, then you listen to every sorts of styles of music. But and you come to a point that you well start to like one artist more than the other. Yeah. Do you still recall what 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 song it was for I've you? Never, no, I've never been a, a, a obsessed with some particular artist. I was, I mean, I was in love with Michael Jackson, of course, and uh, uh, for a while. Um, but I was more obsessed with stories, like The Little Mermaid, for example, or The Phantom of the Opera, or, uh, you know, really larger-than-life stories. Um, and, um, well, I, I do remember when I was really small that I saw John Lennon, I saw The Beatles on TV, you know, the black and white, singing Twist and Shout, and I remember thinking that, wow, he really means what he's singing, and this must be so important for him, you know, singing Twist and Shout. But I remember that moment, and I thought, wow, I'd like to do that, too. But did you already play an instrument back then, or...? I started playing piano when I was nine, but uh, singing was, was the most important thing. So you were saying stories, is it that, that to, well, to live in some sort of uh, creative world? Yeah, I mean, world? in real life I always look for the moments where you, the moments that are larger than life and the, the moments that feel so unreal. I always, I treasure those moments. Well, what was the first time that you had such a moment yourself in your own life? Yeah. Well, probably the first kiss or something like that. <laughs> really larger than life. Yes. <laughs> yeah, it is. Um, that's what you look for also in, in, in songs and in movies. And yeah. I'm all about the little things, really. The, like, it's the little things that does it, that yeah. makes the whole larger than life experience, really. Because maybe in in the in the in the little things sometimes more is said. Yeah, than exactly. But I think it's it's few. Um, when were you actually aware that you that you were looking for this? I think because when at first you have to experience it, but then afterwards you can say, well, this is for me. This is what it this is what it meant to me. Yeah. So what? Um, are you were saying your first kiss, for example. Yeah. But were you actually aware? Then, then. It was. Yeah, I mean, I can, th especially the first kiss, I think I, you know, when every thought you feel like you've ever had is running through your mind like this, like, oh, this is what it feels like, maybe I can die now, you know. Yeah. Um, when it fi feels like your mind is screaming, you know. And what's, what are you were saying, Beatles? Uh, uh, mermaid, yeah. first kiss. Yeah. Um, other uh, music-wise, for your, for yourself, did you also have some sort of larger-than-life experience? With my own songs and with my own. Not, like no, maybe playing the piano, 
performing a song while being young, or maybe just y yesterday. But I was maybe the first time that you had it with your own with your own music or playing an instrument. Yeah, I remember the first time I actually made myself cry <laughs> while writing a song because I just sang what I, you know, oh yeah, this is so, this is actually exactly how I feel. And I managed to put words into it, you know. Um, so yeah, I do remember that. But What song was it? Uh, it was a... Uh, maybe I don't want to say that. <laughs> maybe just keep that moment to myself. Okay, that's good. Um, <laughs> But is it, let's say, is it recently or is it just, just an old song that, that, that has never been recorded? It's a very old song. Has it, has it been recorded? Uh, yes, yes, yes. Okay, so people can <laughs> look. People can search look, for it. Search for yeah. it. Um, 